Hello, it's Mark Lanier with your video thought for the day. Yesterday I taught class and I talked about how important it is that we sing to God. God tells us to do it over and over in the Psalms. And uh, he tells us to do it in, in writings in the New Testament as well, Ephesians, Colossians, various places. You read the book of Revelation, you see they're singing in heaven. Uh, Jesus and his apostles sang. Singing is a part of who we are, and it affects the way we think and the way we act and the way we feel. So I'm, this week, going through five different songs that have really changed my life. Pastor Brent, who puts this together for me, has put down below the link so that you can listen to today's song. It's a song by a fella named Keith Green. Now, Keith died in a plane crash. Whew, it's been almost 40 years ago now. But he put out some spectacular music before he, he died. And this passage comes from, uh, this song comes from a passage out of Psalms 27, verse 4. And I love this psalm as well as the song that Keith put to it. The psalm says the following, One thing have I asked of from the Lord, and that I will seek after, that I may gaze upon the Lord. I want to gaze upon the Lord. And then he adds, to see the beauty of God. I love this idea of taking time in my life to consider and contemplate the beauty of God. And we see his beauty in so many different ways. In the many blessings he's given us in this life in the opportunities he's given us to share his love with others. Certainly as a Christian, I see his love in his sacrificial death through Jesus on my behalf. The love of God is apparent in so many different ways and we need to take time to contemplate the beauty of the Lord and to seek his face, that one thing above all others the psalmist wanted. Which brings me to the Keith Green song. The song is appropriately entitled, O oh Lord, You're Beautiful. And Keith sings, O oh Lord, You're Beautiful. Your face is all I seek. And he recognizes when your eyes are on this child, your grace abounds in me. I love that song because of a number of reasons. First of all, it calls me to gaze upon the beauty of the Lord. Second, the way Keith sings it, it, it so clearly is personal to him. But I really like that it challenges me to go into action as well. Because the more I gaze upon the beauty of God and the more his grace shines upon me, the more it encourages me to make these messages to take his love and to share it with others, to spread around the beauty of the Lord. And Keith sings that in the song, but he sings it with this incredible point to make it the end. He says, and when I'm doing well, in other words, God, when I'm really in sync with you and I'm living your love and showing your love to everyone, he says, and when I'm doing well, help me to never seek a crown. For my reward is giving glory to you. Oh, I want that to be my heart. I hope you do too. That we're not living this life for ourselves. That when we find success in this life, when we find an ability to share with others, to love others, to forgive others, to show mercy to others, to mourn with others, that we never take that as a moment to feel good about what we did, but that we'll take our reward in bringing glory to God. That's what I want to be today, someone who brings glory to God. 
I hope you'll listen to the link below. I hope you'll listen to this song and make it part of your daily vocabulary. Oh Lord, you're beautiful. Your face is all I seek. And that's your video thought for the day.